Market was down a little bit, Dow off 9,000, so okay, it did not happen this week, but Dow 20,000 should be right around the corner, and I say that because of the action of the last few sessions. You see, after such a huge rally, many people, a lot, sitting on big, big gains, and so once this market stalled the last few days and began to sort of back and fill, spinning its wheels, nervous investors had a lot of chances to take profits, and they resisted the urge for the most part. So on that note, the biggest Trump rally winners have yielded some of the ground, some ground in the last couple of days, including most specifically Goldman Sachs, which you have to keep in mind, it has the largest impact on the Dow Jones Industrial Average. But again, there wasn't a sense of panic for the banks or even a broad market, even after knee-jerk selling on the news today that China has snatched one of our Navy research drones in front of a warship. On that score, I say the stock of the session was Honeywell. They let an egg. They gave out their earnings. It was a disaster. The stock cratered right at the start of trading. Now, keep in mind, Honeywell is a diverse company. It operates in multiple industries, aerospace, home building, performance, metals, safety and production, just everywhere you want to be. In fact, all the business segments that should do very well under President Trump. So the stock fought off that early weakness and actually finished higher, almost $3 off the low. Pretty impressive. That's the kind of stuff that I think is a buy signal. Oh, by the way, Trivago, you know Trivago, that cool dude. Well, the company went public today. The symbol is TRVG. Now, I'm not sure if it's a buy or not, but uh, it could be a good sign overall that the IPO market is starting to heat up again. Certainly, it would be a great sign for the economy and the stock market. Now, next week, we're going to get a lot of information on the state of the housing market, although I'm not sure any of the scheduled reports have the ability alone to move the broad market. So 20,000, though, I still think is going to happen because it's going to happen organically. I also think there's a great chance that Donald Trump gets help from, from that fellow in the red suit. That's right, the Santa Claus rally. It should come to the rescue the week of Christmas. And by the way, once 20,000, that hurdle is cleared, I think momentum picks up big time. My Amazon Go report, I'm working on it day and night. That should be ready over the weekend, so make sure you check it out. Ways to benefit from the next wave of disruptive technologies. There's a lot of them. WStreet.com for that.